Right now, let's turn to your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. Chief Meteorologist Tony Petraka is in the Weather Center. Lots of sunshine today, Tony, but the wind not letting up yet. Yeah, still a bit breezy, Brian. Yeah. So, I mean, the actual temperature of 58, which is pretty good for this time of year, then you toss in that breeze. It got a little cool at times. It was one of those days where you had to find a spot in the sunshine out of the wind, and it felt pretty good. I mean, nice down in Newport, uh, blue skies, blue water, and uh, you see more and more of the boats with the tarps off now. Signs of spring and eventually summer. Take a look outside. The sunshine all around. We're looking at North Kingstown. Dry skies looking good. Mid and upper 50s. The breeze, the wind will ease up this evening and during the overnight hours. So while the actual temperatures in the mid to upper 50s, you can almost subtract five or six degrees. Uh, the breeze makes it feel that much cooler, but uh, nice to see the sunshine. What's this? Frost overnight tonight, early tomorrow morning. We have to scrape the windshield. And again, as I mentioned earlier, not unusual. I mean, the average date of the last frost during the spring season is usually mid to late April. Now this is brief. This is like very late at night, early tomorrow morning for a few hours or in the mid thirties and then a rapid jump uh, in the temperature. So satellite photos show skies are clear across New England uh, all around looking pretty good as we look off to the west. Well, first of all, the temperatures and uh, we're seasonable here in southern New England, just maybe a degree or two uh, below average tracking a system across the Great Lakes in the Midwest. This will approach tomorrow uh, late in the day in the form of mainly some extra clouds may squeak out a sprinkle tomorrow evening, but most of this actually dries out, so we're not getting a storm. When we take this into the future, you see that deck of clouds advancing. Now we've got some sunshine tomorrow morning, uh, sun to increasing clouds during the afternoon, but otherwise it's a dry day. Uh, you earn a living working outdoors. It's, it looks pretty good. By tomorrow evening, you see a few speckles of green, maybe a passing sprinkle, and really nothing more than that. Here's a close-up look showing temperatures at around 7 o'clock this evening in the 50s. Skies are clear, but watch how it tumbles overnight. So this is 5 o'clock in the morning. Pasco 32, Smithfield 34, Providence 35, even the coastline mid-30s. So a touch of frost. Sun is strong this time of year. So by 8 in the morning, it's at 42. And then during the afternoon, becoming partly sunny. Clouds on the increase, but 55 to near 60. So we're close to average. Filtered sun through increasing clouds the second half of the day. And then tomorrow evening early, there may be a passing sprinkle, but nothing more than that. They don't anticipate any kind of a widespread rain. 5 in the morning, 35, frosty cold. 11 a.m., it's 20 degrees warmer at 55 and generally like a 55 to 60 range tomorrow afternoon filtered sunshine through increasing clouds. We should finish the day with the mainly cloudy skies. All right, seven day forecast uh, for Thursday, looking at some sunshine clouds late in the day, 59 Friday. Uh, Looks good, warmer. Temperatures in the mid to upper 60s. And on Saturday, not bad. Sunny skies, 62. We'll throw in some extra clouds and slightly cooler weather on Sunday with highs in the mid to upper 50s. Brian and Mike.